Hey guys, Trif Kuchli here today with him. We're back with Fruit Basket episode 11. Yeah, sorry if I look a mess, I just got back from work. Waiting to watch this all day, as usual. For some reason, I'm always stuck at work when Fruit Basket comes out. So yeah, we pretty much it was pretty much right, a light-hearted episode with the Kyo and Toru and the date and um, Valentine's Day thing. But but um, with the dark undertone of Shiga and what he's doing to manipulate Toru. We're not too sure what exactly he's manipulating yet. We're just going to see how like dark, if it's that like, super dark or if it's not. But it's clearly shown that he's a guy who doesn't mind manipulating people to get what he wants. Which makes him a hundred times more interesting. Like I already like this character quite a lot. I love him. He's like a cool like, father figure. But it's also nice to know that he's sort of got that darker side to him that we're going to explore. Which I just didn't expect anything in this show to try and do anything dark. So I'm excited that's actually added something like that. Obviously we've had a few dark elements to do with uh, saying that actually. I take that back because there has been some dark stuff obviously like with the woman who's in charge of the clan. She's done some shady stuff and obviously the sad thing with the memories being wiped and then what and what happened to um the doctor guy so yeah no the show does have like it's on the tone of dark stuff going on which i like it's quite it seems it's got a light-hearted show but down it does have some darker things going on in the background which makes it so much more interesting doing that but yeah uh, like usual love all the characters loving the story i can't wait for when the actual romance part kicks in a lot more obviously it's like sort of this sort of it's more just like building on the characters that are at the moment again introducing everyone introduces in the world understand what the clan's like so yeah once we dive into the romance i can't wait that's going to be so much fun but with that guys hopefully you enjoy this reaction <coughs> i try and do reaction to this every week along with the other season anime so if you enjoy this please like and subscribe and let's get into it gotta keep my voice down because people are in bed just so you know that's why i'm whispering a bit She's so weird, but awesome. The logical conclusion is that I'm an idiot. So much so that my powers can't make up for it. I wouldn't have actually expected that. You can be sure you'll never be the dumbest person in the room. What's that? Pokia. You must have been up there studying the entire time. So it would seem. For some reason, imagining him hunched over a book makes me smile. Honda. Kyo is the best Tsunade male character. I think I've come across many, to be fair. Oh, saving that animation budget. Should I tell you? Oh, nine, I think I'll keep it a secret until the perfect time. Eh? Well, I'm definitely looking forward to it. Good morning. I can't tell if he has the best voice or the worst voice. <laughs> I like and hate it, but for two different reasons. What is that noisy brat doing here? Oh, Did your bath ring? No, I do. I'm excited. Yuki and Kyo will come too. It'll be great. You don't get to decide whether I'm going or not. Yes, hot spring episodes. We just need a beach episode now, and then we've done the full circle of romance episodes. Oh no, festival. No, we need a beach episode, festival, and then club activities. And then that is basically our romance anime in a nutshell. Oh, and then a school trip. That's another one as well. Oh, school trip. Look at that. Yes, I knew it. Shouldn't have to be a burden on anyone. Just accept help. So why was last month any... She spent her money on Valentine's chocolate. Where's your class going on the school trip? Oh, it don't <laughs> Whoa, Kia ran his container. I'm impressed. Oh, I'm bloody hell. Your turn. Go now. That was impressive. Sure. Okay. I, I think I'll go and get cleaned up. See, now they've got to try and make it up to her. Managing to control your anger for once. That was so difficult for him. That's Sartoru. Of course she bought chocolate supplies with her own money. How could we not have caught one earlier? Because she smiles to hide her feelings. How are we? Yes, Keo knows. She shouldn't have felt obligated to give us chocolate. It's because he's best boy. Was make life that much worse for her. She should have used it on clothes or shoes or her trip deposit. What an idiot. She's going to end up... I love how aggressive, aggressively in loving he is. She'll miss out on all the good stuff in life. Hey, you know what? It was called... Funny stories. Funny stories. We read a bunch of them. One of the chapters in the middle was called the most idiotic traveler in the world. As you can guess, the main character is someone on a journey. So when the villagers uh -huh. and tell her she's saving them, she starts weeping. And How could you not feel terrible doing that? I wish you peace and happiness before she bids goodbye. Eventually, she gives away all her clothes. And, embarrassed to be seen, she decides to travel through the woods. Fairy story has a happy ending. Many demons of the forest. They want nothing more than to gobble her up. So each one decides to deceive her with clever words and trickery. As always, the traveler is duped. She gives away her legs and then an <laughs> <laughs> There's 
This is like the opposite of Dororo. Wow, that's a terribly sad story. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's horrible. <laughs> that's a fucking dire story. I guess you got that. It was brutally sad. Was she an idiot? What is she an idiot? <sighs> See, in my opinion, I would say it's an idiot. It's doing what she wants. She wants to help people. Because I think she got fulfilled for it. Oh, hi there, Kyo. I hope you're having a good Hear me. I'll go to the hot Oh, hi there, Kyo. I hope you're having a good Hear me. I'll go to the hot spring. I didn't get you anything in return for the chocolate. So as my gift for you, I'll put up with that damn rodent. Unless you'd rather I stay back here while the rest of you go off on a trip. <laughs> 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 of not. Yes. It'll be so much more fun if you're there with us. This is great. Do, do, do. I'm so happy. This is going to be the best. <laughs> Are you serious right now? May. They why do they always have the cutest shots in the show? The trip's gonna be fun. Yes. I love Kyo. He's a fucking legend. One of my favourite male characters in a quite a while. Oof. What? <laughs> what was with the eye? That's not what this is about. Seriously. I swear, that rat's only No peeking. Fucking attacking him. Girl, she's intense. She doesn't look very ill anymore. Bet she's fun to voice act. Fuck's sake. Oh, has he got chocolate? Ooh, who's gonna give chocolate first, Kyo or him? I love a happy tea too. Is about this. <laughs> Could have bought the girls with her. I got at least two friends. But I wanted her to have a chance to enjoy the hot spring too. My, that's the loveliest thing I've heard in a while. It really is. So sad as well. I told you you have to bounce it first. I always fucking do that. I never bounce the fucking ball. I also find it more cool to do that. <laughs> I can relate. There's a ping pong table at work, and as I always do, is launch it. <laughs> Look, it's hard, Yuki. I can understand your pain, Kyo. I wish I could do that, but I'd get in trouble. This sucks. Real men battle with their fists. You're the one who suggested a ping pong war. <laughs> is this ping pong the animation? Oh, right, nope, she is shit. <laughs> I was having some like hidden hope that she was going to be good. Oh, is Yuki trying to get his chocolates in? Oh, holding him his laughter again. I don't know if he has to leave when he's laughing. He won't just laugh in front of everyone. I really like Toru's Tor voice actor, I've got to say. He does a good job. Oh, oh he's going to do it. Congratulations, Yuki. Oh, I'm going to feel bad for one of these guys. Because assume she's. I'm assuming she's going to get with one of them. And <laughs> I feel really bad for either one if they don't get with her. I'm a, definitely a Toru and Kyo person, but I do like Yuki. <laughs> of course, she's gonna go red. <laughs> she just blew up inside. Man, because this side show just pulling on my heartstrings later. Oh, I'm excited to where the show's going to go. I have no idea. I'm really excited to see what they've got to do with it. They can do so much. Oh. I must apologize for its hair. Huh? What do you mean? Miss Honda, it seems you didn't realize, but 
Momiji is just a year younger than all of us, the same as Haru. Oh. I could have sworn he was only an elementary student. You just got played, Tori. Oh, we're getting some more characters shown a bit longer. This old man will be thrilled the day she wears this around here. Ooh, maybe she'll call me master. He is perverted. Oh, well, I love this ending song. <laughs> this is my favourite ending song of the season. I didn't even think that. Things with this end is things with that ending song. When I first listened to it, I was like, "Oh, but no, I love it." Whenever it goes off at the end, um, I really love that episode. I thought that episode was a lot of fun. Ah, oh, this show's got so much potential. Eh? Uh, I love both the guys. I like Teru. I think that I, lo I love Teru as well. And then quite liking the side characters. There was, she was um, the German guy was pretty. F the foreign exchange one was pretty fun. This episode, um, yeah, just another chill fun episode. I sh like I said, I ship um, Teru and Kyo. I very doubt that's going to change. It might do. Um, I do really like Yuki, and like I wouldn't mind with her getting with either of them, but you just know I feel I'm gonna feel so bad for the other one because I don't see them, or but they're never both gonna get with her, or none of them get with her. That could be an outcome as well. I'd be pretty shit if that did, if they did that. But oh mate, one of them's gonna I'm gonna feel bad for one of them. It's like oh she could date both of them throughout the series. That'd be interesting. I doubt she will anytime soon. Um, I don't think he'd jump into that anytime soon. But God, they've definitely played played the two guy roles. Perfectly, the two guys are perfectly balanced with each other. Like they've got two, two different kind of personalities, and like, anyone could. The thing I've done, anyone could relate to either one of them. Like, um, I prefer Kyo because he's just more. <clears throat> I can relate to his character more, but I could see some people easily um, relating to Yuki more. Um, so it's like that nice balance, and I don't know who, which one's going to get over in the end. And yeah, no, I'm just really excited to see where this goes. Like, I enjoy it. I'll put a smile on my face. Not many photo shows can pull that off. And I've not really watched a romance anime, a good romance anime in a while. Like, the last one I watched was Beautiful Moon, which I absolutely adore. I recommend that if you love romance anime. Um, but yeah, really loving this. Can't wait to see where they're going to go with the story. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the reaction. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe. Hope to see you next week.